Hi everybody, this is Janet Wright and this is going to be an introductory video where I introduce you to the general concepts and healing techniques used in this triplet group energy healing set. Um, it is early April 2019 and the theme of this triplet group energy healing set is heal your mind for focus, learning and memory. And I added memory just today. So if you didn't know that it's going to help memory too, that's why. <laughs> um, so the Friday healing doesn't help memory. It helps your mind for focus and learning, but it didn't help your memory. But I, I tweaked one of the techniques. So for, uh, so the videos will help your memory. Uh, one of the videos and, um, the Sunday and Monday, the Sunday and Tuesday healing, uh, the second and third healings in the set will help memory as well which is good because I need that. <laughs> so it's for focus, learning, and memory. Memory meaning your ability to remember things. Uh, remember what you did yesterday, what you did 20 years ago, but also things that you've studied, things that you've learned because you want to be able to learn, but you want to be able to remember what you've learned too. <laughs> so that's that. Um, okay, so... <laughs> Uh, overall, uh, just some general stats first. Um, there were 60, there are 69 participants in this triplet group energy healing set from a whole bunch of different countries. Um, I don't have the count right now, but you would have seen it scroll by already. I think it's going to be seven or eight countries, um, including five kids. So hi everybody and a special hi to the kids. You're awesome. And, um, so as you know, there's always general healing work um, in every triplet set, which is why every triplet set is a good one to do. So each set has general healing and then theme related healing, right? So this uh, Friday healing was 25 minutes long. So there's this intro video, of course. Um, there's a new video that I made um, for helping you to be present in all your chakras because most of my clients, they need special help they're kind of good in a lot of the upper chakras because they already do aura repair and unblocking grounding every day. Hopefully, once or twice a day, hopefully, they do their aura repair and their unblocking grounding. So they're probably in seven through three, you know, seven, six, five, four, and three. Um, most days, most of the time. So they mostly need help getting into their second chakra and their first chakra. So I did make a new general healing video that helps with that. It helps you hopefully get into all your chakras um, or, or, you know, get as, as much towards that as you can in, in one video. <laughs> you know, it's, it's in, it, growth is always incre incremental. So keep that in mind. But you know, sometimes you need just, a, you know, you need just specific unblocking in certain places and specific healing in certain places to, to be in all your chakras at least for like an hour or two or three or four. So, and the, the more you're in all your chakras, the more you're releasing all sorts of old baggage and you're, you're just at your best. And it, it's, it's a nice cumulative strength building thing to work more and more, to be in all your chakras more often for more hours each day, yada, yada. So that new technique video, I'm not sure what I'll be calling it, but it will definitely have second and first chakra in the title. Um, essentially it's aura and chakra healing for second and first chakra presence. Um, so that's a new technique video that is really general healing work that, so once you do your aura repair and your grounding unblocking, you could just go right to that, you know, on like your average day. Um, if you have more time and you want to go beyond just aura repair and unblocking your grounding, but if you don't have more time, then just stick with aura repair and unblocking your grounding because skipping that and going to other stuff is kind of a waste of your time because if your aura is messed up you know you better fix that um otherwise you know working on other things is just like wishful thinking <laughs> Um, so that's a new video, uh, helping you to be in all your chakras as much as you can, as often as you can. Um, and then, uh, the rest of the general healing done in the set, um, can be represented by two existing videos. So I will put those in the playlist. 
um, the get present in 20 minutes video um, as I've been using for a while now um, that pretty much sums up a lot of the general healing that I did um, get present in 20 minutes is the title uh, it has lots of work on you know chakras or a grounding even creative rings above your head cool stuff um, but then we also did uh, stuff that is in the video seventh and third chakra tune-up which is an older video that already exists so I will put that in the playlist but seventh and third chakra tune-up is the title and that uh, the part of that video that we specifically did is to clear the third chakra connections between body and spirit your body and your spirit and then the seventh chakra connection between your body and your spirit we unblocked those connections so that the energy flows better between your spirit and your body so that is good for so many things i mean last set it helped to do that it helped to be less compulsive about food portions and how much you eat um, and this set, um, actually the reason that I wanted to add that, you know, the unblocking of those connections in this set was more for the newbies that, uh, were participating. Like, um, somebody's dad, um, is a telepathic, telepathic participant in this set. And it's his first set that he on a spirit level is doing, um, in this lifetime. So his seventh chakra and third chakra connections were really needing some help. And uh, somebody else's uh, mom, uh, this is her first uh, healing set and she's also a telepathic participant so she's not one to meditate or anything consciously and so she really needed help with those connections. And then uh, there were some newbies that are conscious participants but it's like their first or their second triplet set so they needed the extra healing at those connections. So, so it, it helps everybody but it was more for the newbies that I threw that in um, and included it in the general healing of this triplet set so again that's the seventh and third chakra tune-up video that will walk you through that so that pretty much discusses all the general healing so it's two no 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 well yeah so it's the get present 20 minutes video which already exists the seventh and third chakra tune-up video which already exists and then the new video which helps you know, it's extra aura and chakra healing for second and first chakra presence. I think a lot of you guys can get a, a ton of mileage out of that one because really most of the participants, that's, you know, they know how to and they regularly repair their aura and their unblock their grounding. So that's sort of their final frontier pretty much is their second layer and their first layer, their second chakra and their first chakra. So that video could be like, for those of you that are more motivated and you're going to do beyond the minimum maintenance each day of unblocking grounding and aura repair then that would be your video that you could go to next to kind of scale build and get more likely to be in all your chakras faster and more often and so that'll be cool <laughs> then i did a bunch of other healing um that one of them is is described in an existing video but the others are all new the others are two more new videos so there's a lot of videos that are relevant for this set just because like there's a lot of things that affect your mind um for learning and focus and memory so um one thing we did is telepathic mesh healing which is a part of the fifth layer of your aura that relates to your fifth chakra your throat chakra for communicating also your mind like peace of mind which relates to focus, your ability to focus on an issue. Your telepathic mesh is this gold, pretty mesh thing that is a part of your energy system, a natural part of your energy system in your fifth layer, but people can cord into it and like kind of scream at you all day, basically. Or sing at you all day. Yesterday I had a client, I, I forgot to like see who it was but i cleared it um but they were sending me this song all day long and it's not a song that i hate but i don't particularly like the song and i kept thinking of that song all day long and i knew it was just a client you know one of you guys basically <laughs> sending me this song and um so i i at first i didn't realize that and I, was, and I was just like singing this song in my mind i'm like you know i don't even like that song who is sending it to me so anyway 
But that's a less sort of harmful, I think, example of, of you know, needing to unblock your telepathic mesh. A lot of times you may have someone who is very frustrated in life uh, with a lot of people in their life. And so they're kind of plugging into your, your kind of your inner voice system here in your fifth layer and they're sending their complaints or they're sending their frustration in and that really impairs your focus. It's subconscious for you, but it'll kind of just, you know, fry your brain and you can't focus on what you need to focus on. So that's an already existing video. So I'm just gonna leave that alone. It's like a 24 minute video, so that's not so bad um, if you do want to heal that. Um, so I'll put that in the playlist. Um, it has telepathic mesh in the title and it, I think it has like a pretty image of like a gold ribbon, uh, like a mesh kind of gold image uh, for that video. So you'll see it easily. So that's sort of the first, I would say, specific theme type healing that was in the set. Um, but then there are two new videos. Um, one of them, and those two new videos are shorter, um, like probably under 15 minutes each. Um, so one of them is clear negative I don't know how the title's gonna be, but it's helping focus. And it's clear, distracting, negative, repeating patterns is what it is. So it's a walkthrough video, and I would help you, you know, do it for yourself. Um, so you can clear, distracting, negative, repeating patterns um, that you may not even be conscious of, but they make it really hard for you to focus. Like say you go into your, you know, your office and you're gonna sit at your computer because you have to do this one specific thing. And then you go into your office and you get on your computer and you do like seven totally different things. And you're like, oh my God, you know, I didn't do what I came here to do, you know? And um, you, what this is, is it clears these subconscious patterns that cause you to kind of derail again and again and again and not be able to go from A to B, <laughs> you know? And uh, so, so, and these are pretty deep. So I made it a short video and we just did one round. We just cleared one distracting, negative, repeating pattern because it, it has to do with baggage from several past lives. And so I figured let's just clear one, you know? And that way, if you, once you've done it and you feel like, oh no, I could do it again. You could do the video twice or you could just speed it up while I'm talking and do two during the video or whatever. You know, um, like in the Friday healing, we did one. We cleared one distracting negative repeating pattern, but probably in the Sunday or, or the Tuesday healing, we'll do at least two each time. So anyway, that's that, that's a new video. Um, and then the final new video for this set is, um, I'm calling it the blue sponge technique. And a blue sponge, like a sponge, you know, um, Maybe one that you use in your kitchen, but I, I sort of imagine it more like a natural sponge, you know, that like they grow, you know? Um, and so it's a, a blue sponge. So you just imagine this blue sponge that represents your mind's ability to learn. And you want your mind to be like an absorbent sponge, right? They can absorb new information, absorb new learning, right? Because sometimes maybe, um, I know like an example is I have this this um, this nutrition book that's sort of like Eastern Western medicine. It's mostly Eastern medicine type stuff about food. And it, when I first got it, I was like, oh my gosh. You know, it's recommended by my acupuncturist and um, uh, I, could, I could, you know, post the title if anyone's interested, just comment underneath. But anyway, when I first got it, I was like, uh, you know, it was kind of overwhelming and um, but more and more, I, you know, read little bits of it here and there, you know, and, and so it all depends on the state of your mind. You feel like you're ready to learn something new. And uh, so that can be worked. So that's what that video helps you with, um, to help you use the blue, blue sponge technique for, to improve your learning aptitude, but also to improve your memory, like your ability to remember what you've learned. Uh, maybe, or just memor to remember things that you did, you know, maybe yesterday or 20 years ago. Um, so uh, we're, that video, a uh, blue sponge technique for learning and memory should be really interesting to use. <laughs> so that's it.
there's a bunch of uh, existing videos that help you know what we did. And then there's one, two, three new videos. Not including this intro that you're listening to right now. There's three other new videos. Okay, so um, let's wrap up this. Uh, oh, and I did want to say that um, uh, the other triplet sets are listed on my on my website and you know I encourage you to jump in uh, if you want uh, more and more new people have been jumping in I mean we, I definitely have all the veterans of course and I love you guys um, but it's always exciting too to hear you know somebody that's watched for you know maybe a few months or a few years and they're finally going yeah you know why not I deserve a healing I you know I want to try it so um, please feel free you know just pay on my website you know you can email me a little hello afterwards uh, my email address is Janet at JanetWrightReadings.com. But I'd be happy to meet you <laughs> and work with you, as well as all the all the veterans and energy geeks out there. <laughs>